slightly higher proficiency on Freya. However, this is Jenny's alt. Yeah. You always gotta take into account. The alt. Alright, so, um, Airbuzz going the, uh, the pot start. Both actually going Maybe the we're not gonna start. see a relog. Maybe he had already relogged. Thank god, I think so. Yeah. So, both actually looking like they're going the same way. Right, yeah, the exact same way, which is interesting because, as we've been saying throughout, Jenny's been, uh, going, uh, the boots too instead of the ramp shroud. Mm -hmm. Even the same, uh, pot. I, yeah, same pot as well. Two blue, uh, one green. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and same leveling. This is literally or two a blue, ditto three match. green, actually. Yeah. Yeah, sorry. Two blue, three green. Ah, uh, and both started purple. Yeah. Jenny popped one early. Airbuzz is popping a mana early. Interesting. How did Airbuzz take, like, no damage from a buff without popping a health buff? Um, reasons. Uh huh. Math and science. Oh, actually, uh, unfortunate for Airbuzz, the creeps uh, went in favor of uh, Jenny there, so he's a little bit ahead. Yeah. But, yeah, right now, I mean, it, it's just everyone's blooping back and forth. A little bit of damage coming out. Yeah, neither from one of them. Uh, Jenny's his... gonna hit five before Airbuzz here, but uh, not off of this wave. Oh, look Airbuzz. at Airbuzz, man. He's so aggressive. Yeah, Airbuzz I love the aggression. aggression. If on. anybody thinks I favor Airbuzz, I buy his commentaries because I love aggression, man. And this man brings it. But Jenny also uh, brings a fair amount of aggression to the table. He usually does it in the form of taunts, so I'm going to mute him. Keep forgetting about that. But, uh, <laughs> yeah. He hasn't taunted yet. I know, but I'm, I am foresee it. Yeah. Both players hitting five, but it was, nope, not deciding to back yet. Yeah, he actually made uh, Jenny lose those two creeps in gold, so. Oh, my yeah. lord. Both putting a lot of damage. I think, yeah. This could be bad, actually, for Airbus. He gets the whoop. Um... Uh... Both wants to Oh, he actually puts himself in a rough position, uh, Jenny. Both players are just going to wait for the other one to ult. He who ults first will lose the engagement here. Yeah, definitely. Remember when Chaos used to be like all Freya did ults, actually? Remember, those uh, were the days. There was Kali I, Freya all the time, and now you barely see Freya. I don't honestly remember. Yeah, I remember, especially I remember people talking about uh, the he who holds first thing. It's always the case in the Freya Ditto. Um, and yeah, this is definitely what we're seeing here. A little bit of a blast from the past, boys. Uh, we see Soup go for cooldown boots, and I am willing to bet that Airbuzz will go the same. Yep. Pots wise, so uh, Jenny has one on one, Airbuzz has two boot. So slight. Difference in the variation of <laughs> <laughs> that really doesn't actually matter, just, you know. But not surprisingly enough, Airbuzz does have the gold advantage here. Uh, he did a very good job of pushing those creeps under Jenny's tower. Yeah, while he does have the gold experience, uh, gold advantage, uh, he also has a slight experience advantage now. Oh, misses the whoop. Kind of rough. Airbuzz looking. A little sloppy there. Missed the majority of his abilities, took half his health for it. Mm -hmm. And he's looking to lose some more gold under tower. It's very, uh. Ooh, really nice counter. Oh. Whoop. Yeah. He's gonna lose some uh, gold just like uh, Jenny did before. They're really evened out here. It's, uh,. It's a close match overall, but I mean, actually, 200 gold in the favor of Airbuzz, which I was not expecting. Both players have only gotten the one buff this game. So far, it's hard to secure a buff with Freya. Her, her jungle clear just isn't that strong. Uh, so it's hard to clear it uncontested. Yeah. Definitely. Airbuzz looking to go for a buff here. Very interesting. 
Yeah, I guess he's uh, low in mana, and this is pretty safe. It's his own blue. Uh, he knows that Jenny's still in lane, and there's not much hope he, ha he can have of uh, coming over to contest it. Yeah. The difference is... Oh, he's not picking up the blue, and he's letting the whole wave go into the tower? Oh, no, Airbus. Airbus, please. That was really poor, honestly. Uh, uh, not to, uh, you know, nitpick too much, but uh, that he missed a full wave there for literally no reason. Mm-hmm. Not sure what he was thinking. I guess he, for some reason, thought that, I don't know, man. Like you said before, uh, Airbuzz definitely is not very much a farming type person. Right, yeah. He's, uh... I mean, that's unfortunately that what it comes down to. Uh, mm -hmm. So, so much of the time, in a ditto especially, man. You can't afford yeah. to be uh, below your opponent in farm. But I will be willing to bet that Airbus hits the majority of the autos in these trades, so. Yeah. So, Airbus now has a little bit more gold than Jenny from the block. Picked up a level 2 Fatalis versus a level 1 Fatalis. More attack speed online. But again, if Jenny keeps nailing these swoops, hey, that doesn't really matter. Attack speed will get minimized by the fact that uh, Jenny's nailing more. Yeah, and Jenny still hasn't taken a buff, uh, other than his initial purple buff, which is interesting. Oh no, yeah, never mind. No, no, he, uh, got, a, he uh, got a red. Yep, he got the red. <laughs> yeah. yeah, see, what he did was much more efficient than what Airbus did. Airbus let a whole wave go. Instead, Jenny uh, just pushed the wave in and went and took the buff afterwards, ensuring that he got all the gold and experience. Uh, you know, um, Airbus wasn't in the same position because he was pushed out, he was low health, but he could have just went and taken that blue and then uh, leached off of the wave. Despite not really being able to get much gold for it, he would have got all the experience. Now he's put himself quite a little bit behind in experience overall. Ooh, Airbus missing that. Ooh. Yeah, taking again, just off the mark consistently here. It seems like Soup, I know Soup plays more Freya than Airbus does, is the thing. Uh, so I think in this matchup overall, you know, uh, it's, uh, Jenny from the block might be a little bit more comfortable than uh, uh, than Airbus. So that's definitely going to weigh in. Yeah, definitely. So Airbus putting a little more damage out. Clearing the wave. Jenny, ooh, that was... Yeah, excellent. Jenny got really greedy going in uh, that way, but uh, will Airbus really be able to do much about it? Doesn't look like it. No. Unfortunately not. Uh, no one's used their ult yet, very surprising, at seven minutes into the game. Neither one wants to... Yeah, exactly. It's, it's really, like I said, it's whoever ults first, so... And Airbus going to the very greedy play of taking the purple here and leaving the two minions behind. Actually, I like that. That was smart because it would have taken too much time and uh, a little bit more mana than uh, he needed to waste there. Mm -hmm. It's also, that... you know, a little cheeky. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> he walks that over, thinks there's a buff. There is no buff. Mm -hmm. The whoop coming out of uh, Jenny as well. It, you can definitely tell that how much time Jenny has put into this uh, character compared to Airbus. Mm -hmm. It's very very accurate yeah every one of the whoops Ginny is hit wow mm -hmm. Airbus is letting a little more go into tower it's pushed out by Jenny and now Jenny goes to clear off the attack speed buff that isn't there pause Here's comes the... out from Jenny uh, and look at the builds exactly the same <laughs> through and through yeah. exactly the same gold too oh my god one gold off Wow, that's actually... <laughs> that's scary. That's actually Neither really Neither player scary. opted into uh, an early active, nothing like that. The exact same builds in the exact same order. At the same time, with <laughs> the same gold, man. The you only don't expect difference... this much out of a ditto, you know? Yeah, the only difference right now is the buffs they have. Right, yeah, yeah. You know, everybody's grabbing a purple and Jenny grabbing a red. Man, this is uh Twins. Twinsies. Neither player is actually leveling the alts, is that correct? Yes, I believe so. Yeah, both uh, going for the pulse irradiate first. Let me check uh Oh no. Actually uh Jenny is leveling the ult whereas uh Airbus oh. is not. 
Airbus looking to trade uh, more through autos, and he's realizing that that the ultimate isn't really what's being used here at all. And it seems like the ultimate overall is not going to be a factor because uh, you know neither player is uh, going to be able to do any damage with the ult. Uh, both players, you know, ult at the same time. Maybe one shot is hit by the person that ults first, uh, or one or the person that ults last actually should get that one shot in. Airbus does have a little bit more points in the uh, Irradiate here, but uh, looks like he's going to take too much from the tower back it up. Mm -hmm. Yeah, again, that, that shows the difference of playstyle versus Jenny. Uh, Jenny versus Airbus. You know, Airbus is playing this massively aggressive game. You know, he's he's going to be the first to die versus mm -hmm. Jenny. Yeah, and perhaps the first to get baited, like in the, the last game with that uh, beautiful Kraken that we saw from Jenny. Oh yeah, definitely. And again, Airbuzz loses tower or loses golden or tower just because he's not he's not playing as smart. Yeah, he certainly isn't. Uh, overall, we've seen more control uh, in both the fights and in lane and uh, experience uh, from Jenny. Oh, here's, here's the, the major difference. Yeah. Is that what you're gonna say? <laughs> That's exactly what I was gonna say. Yeah, Airbus. <laughs> Yeah, Airbus going for 40 additional damage in the Telkine's ring compared to the demonic grip from out from Jenny. Look at the difference here in this fight, actually. Oh no, too much missed from Airbus. Jenny is going to be able to ult in response easily to this. Gets on it, dead. First blood goes to Jenny. Yeah. I imagine he's taunting, was he? Yep, he yep. was. <laughs> um, yeah, that was just really unfortunate. Um, the thing there was with the extension of that fight, the demonic started doing so much more because it, uh, because Jenny opt, I mean not Jenny, Soup. Oh my God, not Soup. <laughs> Airbus opted into the early telekinds, which gave him the protections, but the demonic just shred those protections. Yeah, this is it's he the point the, of demonic. Yeah, he got the stacks online, and it's early low protections too, so easily shredded, uh, and it just goes right through it, man. I liked it, you know, it could have been really strong uh, in that play, had uh, Airbus like disengaged and then re-engaged once the stacks had wore off on the demonic, but instead but he missed the majority of the autos and then he just committed with nothing to offer really. It was just an unfortunate circumstance. Oh, misses the whoop. This could be bad. Yeah, this Again, is so this funny. is just decimation a, it, from Jenny. This demonic. Yeah, it's looking like it's game, man. This was, uh, you know, Jenny just completely outbuilding. Uh, right, yeah. Such a crucial uh, mistake, too. Ooh, uh, is that an Achilles spear I see from Airbus? <laughs> I guess he's going for broke here, man. I don't know. We've seen him do it before, and it's actually been very successful. But at this point, I don't know. The Achilles spear is usually an early game item to help you with, uh, with jungle clear. Uh, and I would have liked to see it from him earlier, but right now I guess it's, it kind of just seems like desperation because he doesn't have enough damage to kill Jenny, and he's gonna hope that he can burst him down with a an early combo with it. Mm -hmm. But I mean, yeah, this big of a lead on um, in a mirror, it's not not looking good for our hero. Yeah, our hero, of course, because Airbus came through losers. Uh, whenever somebody makes that big trek, you know, you get to see more of their matches. You're a little bit more invested in the player, things like that. But Jenny here has been uh, overall very, very dominant throughout this event. Uh, yeah, has definitely. yet to drop a game. Jenny's been playing lights out. Airbus playing really well too, but he's just dropped with these past couple games. I'm surprised, man. Every time that Jenny has opted into a Freya, we we have seen either a Magical or another Freya play into him. We haven't seen him have to fight the Freya versus ADC matchup, which is what he really should be aware about whenever, uh, or what he should be worried about whenever he drafts into it. Ooh, Airbus, uh, a nice defense here, but he, oh, he popped the Achilles Spear. Wait, he could lifesteal off of the creeps more, but he opts uh, into backing off. He could have. Yeah aggressed there, kept life stealing off of the creeps, and I guess what he was worried about is that he'd take more damage, but oh, damn, not dude, bloody. that's probably going to be, maybe not an F6, Airbus really, really wants this, man, he's not ready to give it up, but it's, it's looking pretty grim, 
It's just yeah. an unfortunate circumstance, man, to uh, get uh, overpowered in the ditto like that. You know, this is uh, this is sort of the playstyle we've kind of been expecting from Airbuzz, just the, the hyper-aggressive style, and Jenny knows how to counter that. Right, yeah, he waited for Airbuzz to aggress onto him, and then he started swinging, man. He realized mm -hmm. he had the demonic over him, or he had a Telkine, had a noticeable power spike, stripped him of the protections, and overall, though, Jenny was more confident in the engagement, more confident yeah. in the character overall, it seems like, as well. Oh, yeah, definitely. Oof. All right. Did he just so. buy a pot? Yeah, everybody just bought a pot to try to bring himself back into this. Uh, yeah. I respect it. Um, we saw him totally doing this a lot lately, um, and it makes sense because, like, how else are you really going to uh, afford the damage that you need? He pops the Achilles Spear. Really, really powerful right now, actually. Oh, a lot uh, but of look at the desperation whoop come out from Airbuzz, man. Oh no, Airbuzz is swinging at nothing. Destruction. That might and be game. Yeah. Yeah, Anything Airbuzz was just trying. Uh, I don't know, man. It, it's just, you, feel, you really feel it in a ditto when you're that behind. It's three levels right now. Uh, 2,300 gold, it's just rough. But I do respect the fact that he's holding on and keeps trying. It's just, you see so much uh, dominance overall from Jenny. He's not going to let this one go, you know? He doesn't let games out of his grip when he has them. Mm -hmm. Right now, Airbus about another pot. He's just desperate. He cannot... Uh, he doesn't want to take this loss. He knows there's a lot on the line. It's a big tournament. He wants to go for it. He's certainly going for it. Yeah. Like I said, I definitely respect it. And I mean, not F6ing in the uh, in the finals is, is definitely very admirable. He wants... Uh, he wants the win, man. He's somebody that came up from pretty much the bottom, and he's not known well in Joust, anything like that. And he uh, he really made a big name for himself just through these uh, through this tournament series uh, and the weekly tournaments in general. So you know, a lot of respect for the player. Um, Soup just seems to have his number right now. Yeah. Oh, definitely. The fire creeps as well. There's just so little Airbus can do. Oh, but he's he's playing that smart. He got. You know, he popped yeah. the shield from... He's out of dodge there, yeah. Yeah. But it's just the damage-wise. He's fighting back very well, but the whoops are always on Jenny's side, man. He's been really, really putting uh, putting in work with these whoops each time. That was devastating. This might be GG. Yeah, and I think I'm definitely going to put the, uh, uh, the taunt spam... Uh, rule up for uh, any of the next events that I uh, run. It's just bad sportsmanship, especially for community ran tournaments. Jenny could have ended right there, but decides not to. Yeah. Uh, nope, but Airbus is just kind of letting it go. <laughs> yeah, Airbus has had, had enough. Yeah. He's like, I'm done, man. I'm done. There he goes, GG. Yeah, GG, a very, very uh, impressive play overall from Jenny from the block, man. Like we said, he didn't drop a single game and he showed an extremely dominant performance. Mm -hmm. Really high level play and um, did it without any ADCs actually, uh, to our G knowledge. Yeah, didn't very, very interesting. see a single ADC played from this man. Uh-huh. And that's it for the tournament, guys. Thank you so much for coming. Yeah, guys, that's going to be it for the uh, Death From Above series. Uh, second place goes to Airbuzz. First place, uh, of course, to uh, Jenny Soup, a.k.a. Jenny from the Block. Um, third place going to Beluga. All amazing competitors, guys. Make sure you give them props in the chat. Thank you guys all so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Uh, remember to follow the channel if you aren't already. Remember to follow Extreme Man on Twitter and on Twitch. We'll drop his information in the chat. He's my he's been my co-caster here for the day, guys. I hope that you enjoyed. 
And thank you all so much again for coming out.